everybody, what's going on? It's your boy, Worst Seven Gamer, and I'm back with another hero spotlight. Today, we have a brand new hero just released in the game, guys, and we're about to go ahead and spotlight him. But first, before we do that, I gotta try my luck and see how long it's gonna take me to get this guy and how many stars will I be able to get him. Because as you already know, I've saved up a shit ton of diamonds, man, the last few weeks. I've been uh, spending and I've been saving my diamonds. I really have no need to, you know, spend diamonds in this account right now. So it's all about our boy Morpher here. And I don't know if I should call him Morpher, like Morpher or Morpher, 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 Morpher. God damn it. It's hard as hell to pronounce this guy's name, but let's go ahead, guys. Let's not wait any longer. Drop a like if you're excited about Morpher and drop a like if you want to see this guy Orange Plus 2 maxed out. Uh, maybe like six or seven start. How about that? What is my luck? We're gonna find out with the first pull. I'm gonna do a 50 pull guys first pull 50 give them to me, please Hell no Damn it, Raxius. All right, we're gonna not waste any more time 10 pull. Come on. I need to get this guy like seven stars Fuck. Damn that was not good All right, we only got four pieces. That was a shit pull guys. Not cool at all, man. All right next one Second temple! This will be good too. I will accept second temple. Alright, this one we got eight. Alright. Third temple! Come on, Morphier! Come to daddy! No! Ah! Well, we got four in that one there, which means we're getting closer, guys. We are getting closer to getting this guy, and it's gonna be now! I feel it in my. No, I don't. I don't feel it anywhere. Oh man, that's only 26. The longer it takes for me to get him, the lower the stars I'm gonna be able to get him. So that's bad. I need to be able to pull his card so I can get this guy to higher stars. Oh my god, Morphir, you're killing me! You're killing me, Morphir! Come on, baby, give him to me. Hmm. Is that possible? Not even one soul stone? What? Come on, game. Yo, if you do a temple and you don't get one soul stone, that's pathetic. That makes you just want to beat slap the shit out of somebody, man. Come on, what the hell is going on here? No! Oh my god! I thought I got him. Oh man! Even though she's hot as hell, look at them tits. Damn, dude, are you serious right now? Yo, just because she was purple, man. And this dude looks purple as hell. Oh, how bad can my luck be? Yo, what is going on? All right, reset. Reset. All right, let's try it again. Start over, man. Shake of the luck. Bad freaking luck for me right now. Bad luck. Damn, that didn't help at all. We're at 48 pieces, man. Come on, game. Hurry up. We don't want to wait any longer. What the fuck? This gotta be it. How long has it been? Yes! Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Yes, guys! The Night Hunter Morphier is on the team. Yo, this dude looks pretty freaking sick. Look at them blades. Wowzers, Bowsers. Wow! Alright, so let me address something before I go any further, guys, because I know this is coming. It happens all the time. To all the guys that play Hero Charge and moved on from Hero Charge to play Soul Hunters like I did. And they, they're gonna hit me up and they're gonna say, Yo, that's Arcane Sapper from Hero Charge. Oh, this game copied it. Guys, for the last freaking time, Hero Charge copied Soul Hunters or, in reality, Hero Charge co uh, copied Dota, which is uh, the same as... Soul Hunters, right? Same company! So, I don't want to deal with this anymore. This guy is not Arcane Sapper. This is Morphier, a brand new hero to Soul Hunters. And I can't wait. I'm so excited to get this guy's spotlight going, guys. So, let's go ahead and let's go to the next step. Alright, so here we go. This dude is beautiful. Look at him. Oh my god, I can't wait to get this guy all the way maxed out. So, let's go ahead. First things first, upgrade him to level 100. Let's not play around the level 1 here. And then begin the fusion, guys. Uh, I wish we can fuse to the max level right away. How about that? That would have been awesome. 
Like, if it would just let you fuse to the max, and it'll tell you all the items that you would need, right? It should be able to do that. Like, fuse to the max, and then say you're gonna need these many items. And if you want to, you can do it. If not, you don't have to do it. But, I want to, I want to. Max out everybody in this account. That's the goal. Use! Alright. Purple. Oh, I can't wait to look at this guy's abilities, guys. Oh, I'm so freaking excited! Can't wait to look at his abilities, max them out, try them out in battle. Woo! And, uh, Thursday's stream is gonna be lit, because we, this guy, by then, his abilities should be all the way maxed out by Thursday night's, uh, Twitch stream. And, uh, we will be able to test this guy out on a real life, you know, arena battles. Because, uh, depending on how many stars, I will be able to get him. So, stick around for the end of this video, guys, because... I'm going to go ahead and try to get this guy to a higher star, and we'll see how far I can take him. I'm already 52 out of 100, so we're close to 4 stars. One more pull, and we should be able to get this guy 4 stars right away. It's all going to depend on how many times I can pull his card. If I can pull his card a few more times, it would be awesome. Alright, so this is orange plus 2 right here, guys. Boom! Mm, orange plus 2. Come to daddy. More fear. Alright, I'm going to give him this. I'm going to give him all this good stuff here. Yep. Give him everything. I will enchant all this stuff off screen, so don't worry about that. Uh, first things first. Abilities. Let's break down those abilities and let's see what he's going to do here. Void Blast. Morphir dashes behind the enemy with the highest magic attack and releases a Void Blast that deals huge magic damage to the target and enemies around it. Whoa, what? Alright, so this guy is a magic dealer? Magic damage dealer. But not only just one guy, it hits everybody around. The highest magic attacker. Ooh, anti-magic hero. Wow, uh, can you pair this guy up with Tanya? Is this guy... Yo, this guy looks like he's Tanya's soulmate. Because Tanya is very similar to this too, right? Touch of Darkness. Morphir dashes behind the enemy with the highest magic attack. Same... Whoa, this is two abilities. And attack him. Attack him? How do they know it's a him? What if it's a her? Most likely it's a her. They're all magic. Anyways, all dealing physical damage. Also dealing physical damage. And uh, depleting energy for... Oh shit, of enemies in a small area. Yo, this is pretty fucking sick. So both of these abilities not only hit one certain target. So his ability, his ultimate is going to do magic damage. This one is going to do physical damage. So multi-purpose uh, damage dealer. This is sick. Magic and attack. And not only does he hit the enemy that he's attacking, but also enemies in a radius around that hero. I'm not sure how far the radius goes, but if it's... It's probably going to be just enemies that are close by. That's pretty sick, dude. Oh my god. Blade Dance. Increase Morpheus' physical attack. Alright, so this is a... This just increases his attack. Uh, we also have... a. Uh, Gorgon Shield, Morphe uses his uh, profound knowledge of magic to protect himself, increasing magic armor. Whoa! Oh my god, this guy is a completely anti-mage, guys. Probably the best anti-mage in the game, I'm guessing. Everything about him, he attacks magic dealers, he increases his mage uh, magic armor. And then he's got an awakening as well, so this is lit, dude. This guy is freaking sick. When Morphe uses his Touch of Darkness skill to dash the enemy with the highest magic attack, he will also cast a magic shield on himself that lowers incoming magic damage. What? Are you kidding me right now? This dude is insane. Alright, so pretty much I can already see it, guys. If you're in the battle and you're using any magic girl or any magic hero, you're fucked. You're dead. This guy is going to destroy them. So let's go work on all these abilities a little bit at a time here. Let's bring everything to like six. Right? Yeah, that's good. All abilities to six, so let's go ahead and let's try this guy out in a battle. But we can already kind of know what he's gonna do. Let's go! Alright, here we go, guys. So it's just him and himself right here. I didn't really use anybody else. Let's see what he's gonna do here. Boom! Okay, perfect. Obviously, Osiris is the hero with the most magic attack there. So he jumps right in front of her and then just starts slashing away. Pretty slow there. So his attacks are a little bit too slow. He's not like Volko, because Volko goes crazy, and Tanya also goes crazy too, so he does a little slower damage, but I'm guessing it's a lot more. So let's go ahead, use his ultimate here, and Kapuya! Woohoo! Nice! So area damage, obviously like it says, hits everybody in a small radius. Boom. 
There we go. Yes, that's pretty sick. Uh, attack is pretty high. 9,000 right now. Very low level of an attack. So who's the magic dealer here? Automatically, you got to counter magic. Uh, is Kanye going to be the highest magic dealer here? Nope. So if there... Ooh, I got to use his ultimate, guys. Ultimate now! Oh, he got interrupted there. That was bad. No, jump! All right, he's going to die here. I just can't... He's got some pretty good lifesteal, though. Because he is regaining his health pretty quickly here. Boom! Let's go. All right, so his abilities are very easy, guys, to tell what they are. He doesn't really do anything tricky. He goes by the books. No trick here. Wow! Killed everybody in one shot there. Ha! Okay, let's just go ahead to the final round and see what he's going to do here. But, yeah, it's very simple, guys. Jump. All right, get out of here, Elric. Jump to the enemy with the highest... Oh, I got to do this quick. Go now! Oh, he's dead. All right. That's okay. We don't need any more proof of this guy's beastiness. 200k, that's a lot. Alright, so I was going to jump into the Hero Academy to work on his Hero Academy, but uh, there's some kind of a glitch here, guys. He's not here yet. Hmm. So they haven't added him to the Hero Academy just yet, so probably give it a day or two until they realize, and then they add him on here. So, on to the next one! Alright, so there's nothing really else to do for this guy in battle-wise, but we have to work on his stars now, guys. So let's go ahead... And try to get this guy to a higher level star here. Alright guys, here we are. So, what I just realized is this event is going from the 17th to the 21st. Which is like Saturday, I think. So, actually Saturday in the morning, which means AM. So, pretty much Tuesday to Friday. And I kind of want to do this on live with you guys. So, I can pull as many as I can live during Thursday's stream. So, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to pull enough to get up to 4 stars. And then I'm going to save the rest. For Thursday night, so you're gonna have to come check me out on Thursday night and see how many, you know, I'm gonna spend a lot of gems then, maybe 30,000 to see how many stars I can get this guy in then, but for now, let's go ahead, if I can pretty much pull one hero card, I, I'll be able to get this guy to four stars, so let's go four stars for this video, and then we will end it, ooh, 58, and then we'll continue on Thursday live stream, guys, and get this guy to like six, seven stars, at least six, I'm hoping, Ah. Oh. Uh, I'm at 64. I literally just need one more pull. Come on, luck. One more pull. No! Why must they give me Zeno? Why? Oh, I did get one of these, though. This is a sick... No, it's not. The fight. This is terrible. Ugh. I thought it was a good item there, but it's not. Not at all. Come on, I just need this card right now. Oh, my God, dude. They just irk me with these pulls. Now is the time. Now. Fuck! What the hell? Oh my god, dude. Alright, 76. Come on, Kane. I'm ready for you now. I am ready. No shitty pull. Oh, oh that was actually a bunch of... 88. Oh, I only need 12 more now. Now I'm pretty much going to get it without even pulling the card. Now I just need to get... There's 2, 4, 6, 8 more. Um, 96? Alright, last one here. I, all I need is 4 more. Okay, that's it. Just 4 more. And we are there. 4 pieces. There we go. We got 4 pieces from the beginning. And some extra ones. Alright, so let's go ahead. Let's get this guy to 4 stars. And be done with it. Alright, here we go. Promotion in the ocean. 300k. No problem. Four star Morphair at the moment right now, and hopefully you can get this guy to five, maybe six, depending on how good my luck is. But definitely five on Thursday night stream. All right, guys. So for now, I'm gonna end it off here. I hope you guys like this guy. He's gonna be a sick arena hero. I feel like he's gonna be very, very situational. To be honest, right now it's a lot of physical hero meta. So the meta game is physical heroes, pretty much. You know. Petros, Volca, Orkan, Garic, uh, Magnus, all these guys are all physical heroes, and this guy is going to fit right in for the physical heroes, but anytime, you know, you're in the epic arena, and you, you don't really know what your opponent is using, and they have this guy on their second or third team, and you're running any type of magic heroes, you're dead, you're pretty much screwed, this guy is going to kill your magic heroes really quickly, alright, so, he's going to be pretty good in the arena, Everywhere else, I just do not see any hope for this guy in the raids and the Hall of Legends. I just don't see it, man. To be honest, this guy looks like a strictly a sick arena hero, but that's about it. 
Alright guys, I'm out of here. I gotta go right now. I will catch you guys Thursday night. Alright, peace out everybody!